welcome back to my channel and welcome back to playing Suju once again. I think I want to do this a weekly thing now, but we are doing my dailies again, entering some competitions, giving my opinion about current events and outfits. And I have a challenge for you later in the video, so stay tuned for that. And now let's get into today's video. So starting off, before it's gone, because it expires in literally 13 minutes, someone said in the last video I should try doing the full pulls and I still had six pulls left. I didn't figure that I would still be here recording. So I did my six pulls to get to like the 20 required to get like another item. And your girl actually pulled a back front piece. It wasn't the flowers that I wanted, but I feel like this one is still really, really pretty. So I'm not mad about that one, but we do have this one still and I only need eight pulls. I think I can buy enough. Maybe not, but if I can get enough diamonds today, maybe we can do another pull to get to see if we can get any for the 10 star let's start off by checking my results for this expensive fur coat i went full star kiss mode on this one i don't think it's that popular i just think the pose looks really good with the coat because it's like double fur coat and i got in the top 20 percent for this one so we do get 60 diamonds for this everyone has like really really pretty dresses but no one's going for pink here i'm surprised honestly now let's start off by doing my daily so of course i'm gonna like a five posts first i am still so daunting on getting this dress. Someone talked me out of it because I am spending too much money on fashion games the past few months, but the dress is just too cute. So we have done uh, this one. Let me claim my daily gem pass. It's an easy one. And then also skipping. I saw someone say that if you click on this on the right time, so I think at the 1200 coin one, when it's like almost halfway, that you always get diamonds. So let's see if this is true because I tried to test it. It only worked once. So if you click right here, wait, you just saw me. Okay, I don't know if it's coincidence. Someone said it. Maybe I'm just not good at it. I don't know. So I can claim these two as well. I'm going to use a skip video because I want the 15 diamonds. We can claim this one too. There is a new event. I'm such a big fan of this outfit. So this is like, I think like the April Fool's outfit uh, because it has like the clown things. My birthday is on April Fool's Day. So I take like this very personally. I really like it. I already made the socks. So the way you get these is by going to the feed and then just start scrolling until you you find somewhere the little clown character or is it am i missing something it's not showing up for me I had to restart the app it didn't show up on the top for some reason but you can see it in here well it's a crazy picture and then it comes a little character and then you get the little clowns in return so let me just quickly get these yeah it's easier now <laughs> now that they show up phil wait what was that why did it say phil wait a minute so i can Okay, it doesn't go off your daily limit. I was about to say, if it fails and I can't even get it, what, what's the point? That's what? That was the point of fail, just so you keep scrolling more. So that's the point? I don't know. All right, our last one. Let's see if I can redeem something else already. Like I said, I already got the socks. I normally skip on like the title and the banner because I don't really use those. I also really don't like these two background pieces. So I think I'm going to leave those for now. Uh, let's go with the overalls because these are really cute. Let's go craft them too. They are part of the bottom section and these are so cute i can't wait to use those and for the rest i just want to spend my stamina so i'm just gonna throw it in here for the master course and then the rest just like on the regular whichever i don't have that many off whatever this is i don't really have anything i'm crafting right now so i'll just throw in my stamina somewhere and we can claim two more here then next up i wanted to have a look at the shop because there is a new collection there was a little bit of controversy about the guy's outfit which I I don't know what to think. I don't really like it that much. Uh, besides it being really expensive, I just think it's kind of like weird, but it's not my cup of tea. So I'm just not really been looking at the beast stuff item, but I really, really like this dress and I kind of want to get it, but I'm so broke. I would rather do the, the pulls for that audio event, I think, but this dress is so cute. I don't know. I also really want the makeup and kind of the hair too. I just think it's really cute. I don't know how I feel about this one though. I feel like the coat could be really useful, but maybe I'll get to that. I did buy D2 gold items obviously so i'm just gonna spend my money on just buying some of these items because i don't have those yet and i need to buy three items and spend coins so that's another two dailies out of the park here and that's already done <laughs> then i did also forget to do my pulls for this one last time but i think i'm just gonna save my tickets until the next gotcha video so i just have like more to pull for because this is kind of like sad how many i have now we have four competitions lined up so let's go straight into the first one this is rebel soul style rebel rules look tonight i'm gonna be honest i think this is one of my least favorite ones to do because this one comes back 
so often like the most i think i don't know i don't really like to do this one but we will anyway one thing oh i want to say i really wanted to use the car background piece because i just got that one for playing for a year but i don't think it's unlocked i don't really like rebel style it's not really my thing i think it's like dark streetwear like like black clothing i don't know it's not really my cup of tea because i always make it too gothic anyway i don't even know which makeup to use honestly let's go with this one i feel like this kind of fits the rebel theme i'll just use the tag because i am so 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 lost because everyone does this one all the time and i think the black letter is kind of boring but again i don't really have any shorts like these don't fit the rebel style so maybe i should do the one piece for once oh we can do this jacket this jacket the recolors for real i don't know because if i do a black jacket maybe we can do this one i don't know this is not my best comp i'm just kind of <laughs> put a little excess glaber for this because i always mess this one up this one never ranks good for me Let's do this torn one hair accessories what what Mm, the cat ears maybe do we have a recolor for this jacket oh we do we do oh let's just do that that makes the outfit way more interesting that changes the whole look okay never mind i am okay with this and if for hair we could do this one with the tail too or is that not really rebel it's like e-girl goth girl kind of maybe i'm gonna change the makeup because i kind of don't like it but let's just put on some accessories to make it a little bit cooler maybe a bag this outfit i don't know man you know what? I'm gonna go for this one. <laughs> She's more goth girl. I don't know if seen as rebel. It's definitely my first rebel outfit that is pretty unique. So I'm just gonna leave that. Then next up is court new look. And this one has the items from the gotcha. Good thing I already have a bunch of things. So let's see. I don't have the hair. I have this dress. I have this lace top. I'm just gonna put everything on first before I can see what I can do with what we have because there isn't that much. But yeah, this all looks really cute together. The red with the dress. I think it least but i got the ring all right i don't think we need all of these things but it says lace item cord item what is cord item oh what if we did a cord dress instead then it's a different gotcha it's the it's the thought that counts right because it still has all the requirements here changing the makeup to this one because that like changes the whole vibe too and then for accessories i want to use oh this oh this is the new frame do i like that i think i do i think we should go for like the pinkish so it's like pink and red wait let me add the red petals right I think we're gonna go with this. I know it doesn't even look like the gacha, but I like it. And let's see. I really want those pink leather gloves. So let's see if I can get in the 15% if I use like a really high perfume. I always save those for like special occasions, right? But well, let's do the rose petals and then have our fingers crossed that I can get in the top 15 with this one. It's pretty, okay? It's like, it's not that unique, but it is pretty. And then we have long haul flight time to travel the world. But first you need a comfortable outfit for a long flight there. Slippers, casual and simple. So it's like an airplane outfit fit but honestly i want it to look royal like expensive so because she's probably in a private jet so we can do these like chanel slippers i think those are really cute as for casual simple i don't know if i want to do this one we like that in silver maybe we should let's try and make this one to see because that looks more expensive and if she has like a little a little dress underneath like this one right because she's still like fancy she's still rich right and then her hair has to be either down or in like a bun this one always does well i think so i want to go with that however this one is also one of my favorites i prefer this one right now but for the makeup i don't know maybe we should just do the one where you can see the lips well and then just add sunglasses right and then okay this is gonna put the, 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 the make it make it all perfect wait boom that hair bow it does it it really does it for me at least she's like cutie rich give her the back like the black and white makes her look like super posh i think at least and then we can can add background pieces which i'm debating if i want to do i want to keep it a little bit simple so i do want to add like three but i don't think i want to do anything extra on top of that like these oh this was the lamborghini i was talking about or is it not i mean supercar sorry but that doesn't fit on the airplane so we're not going to do that actually we can do this gold okay this is good this is cute it's simple airplane vibes i really like this one i think we're done i don't know if it's gonna do well we'll see top 30 percent 60 gems so fingers crossed i'm out of tickets for the last one so let's do a few photos to get a few more tickets i really really am upset the hair is a recolor from the five star blue set that was from the gacha i did monday and that outfit like that hair is so cute in that recolor so i was really hoping yesterday for that one pull that i did to get that dress or the hair and i didn't get it i mean i'm happy with the background piece i got i got don't get me wrong but oh it makes me kind of sad that i missed out on that but it's gonna come back someday and then i probably do pulls for it again or there's gonna be hair that's probably cuter than that someday too these outfits are really cute 
Cutes or the Casablanca. I don't really like voting for the male characters. I feel like no one really invests in male characters. So everyone has the same 40 items, which is kind of boring to vote for. But I noticed that I always rank high with these because how easy it is to score high because no one really styles men that much. I don't know. All right, almost there. Uh, This one. I'm really sad I don't have these background pieces. I'm, I'm thinking about getting more because sometimes they're really nice for like making photo props, but I don't like that you can't use gems. Like you have to spend money in order to get them. And I don't always feel like it because I normally use my blight gems for pools instead because you get a dis whoa discount. Anyway, let's move on to culinary master. Food handheld, food decoration. Photo theme, invite friends to dinner at home. Let's make a big meal. Straight up, I want to use the apron, this one. And we have recolors, which I have in blue since I want to use that since that's like a little bit more different because maybe a lot of people are going to use it, okay? I don't know. And what do you wear underneath an apron? You're cooking, you're trying to stay busy, but you want to look good because when you take it off, you're hanging out with your friends. So maybe a long sleeve top that matches underneath maybe this white one. That's so cute. It's giving Alice. I like that. And then underneath, I'll just do a skirt so you don't see it. But like, if she's going to go sit down, then, then she can take it off. Food item, we have a lot. I think I'm going to go for the apple because I feel like the other ones are a bit menu maybe, but she's like with friends at home. So it's either going to be wine. You know what? Let's go for the wine. I think I have to use other food items too because the selection is like super short, but like I don't have that much. Like if I do this one, I want to do the pink dress, but I kind of don't want to do that right now. Like the shoes count. I think I have to take a photo. Okay, so if I, <laughs> this is my cheat sheet, okay? If I have to like do a certain amount, I'll always put like somewhere down so you can just crop it off because no one's seeing the shoes anyway. So if I put the, the socks and the shoes in the strawberry, it gives me a little score boost here. You know what? Maybe we should do the pink after all because then I make her look really sweet. Like she has friends over. Like this is kind of a vibe. Okay, wait. You don't really want to be wearing too much jewelry when you're cooking because then it might get into the food. This is overkill if I do double pink. Like there's a lot of pink. Actually, this one is really cute. Let's do that. It's not that like big and majestic, but I think it can go with the look. I'll add this one to the back too. I just love using the shawl because it's like, it's so big. It really fills up the space. So she's cooking. Oh, we need to use a food decoration. I wish I had that cake. You know which one I'm talking about. We have the, the jelly. So I guess that can go <laughs> into the pot. She's cookie jelly with wine. You know what? I should change her handhelds. Yeah, let's do ice cream. Else is a bit weird. Okay, this is good. And then the rest, I guess I get to decide what I want. So I'm just going to make it all pink. I don't think I have the much to add. I tried to add the rug. I, it's not straight. Hold on. I would change the background, but no one likes when anyone does that. So we're just going to go with this. Uh, I don't know. Okay. <laughs> uh, it is definitely interesting. Let's hope we get the top three so I can get at least some gems back for this. But I don't know, man. All right. Those were all of our competitions. Now let's go make an outfit. Oh, we got a new achievement. Total of 33 star dying. And I only get 10 gems for that. Wow. I'm kind of sad we don't have enough gems right now to do another pool. But I might do that off camera. So for today's post, I did want to do something completely in blue because I'm wearing blue today. So I'm feeling blue, but not in a sad way. So <laughs> let's make a blue look. I I, don't know, I should use like items I don't really use that much, honestly. Actually, let's use the mint hair. Already starting off with a different color. I don't know what color it's supposed to be, but I do know it has the sporty tag. It's this one. What color is this supposed to be? Because I didn't show up at blue, but this is the one I want to use. I don't know if I want to change my skin tone too, because I do have the blue one. Mm hmm. I don't think so because I don't have any makeup that looks good with this. I have the blue makeup. Okay, that kind of works. All right, let's continue. Let's see if I have any blue turquoise. Do I only have this one, really? We can do this top because it kind of matches the... Wait, this one comes... Oh, this will be so good. I really want to do it. I'm going to do it. I know I saved these up for so long, but look at this. Come on. Like, ah, come on. That looks so good. Okay. And then I don't have any turquoise here. Let's see for the shoes. Not really. We can also do like white or silver with this because I feel like that also look nice. So I'm just going to leave those empty for now. I don't really want to use the seashells either. I'm surprised how many little accessories I have in that color. Wait, I like this, but I don't like that it cuts off like right there. The, the, the line is too harsh. Let's skip on that too. Let me try look on silver then. Because we do have silver shoes. Silver cape. Oh, this is kind of pretty actually. Wait. Or this one. I kind of like like both. But wait, am I actually making a good outfit out of nowhere? I'm so excited about this one. That's crazy. 
I'm just not sure about these shoes because I feel like the, the, the platform makes them look a little bit too chunky and I need something more delicate like these, but these don't come in silver. I think I'm just going to go for white shoes, just like small ones because I don't like how, how chunky they are. They, they take attention away from here. I love this so much. Now to fit the whole blue theme, I'm just going to go with this one again. I think I just used that background, but I only have like a few blue and whitish backgrounds and this one just matches our theme just the best. Let me position my character first. Now, depending on what background pieces I want to use, I feel like I already use this one so much, but maybe we can try and like turn it around, literally. Pull the damn phone. Does it look good? Does it? I think it does. I don't really don't want to overdo it. So I'm going to like keep it cool with the background piece. I think I'm going to leave it at what we have right now. I'll add the roses in too to make it more look like a bush. But I'm going to I'm going to be chill with this one, okay? And I feel like the bubbles are going to do well. Okay, I really... I'm such a big fan. I'm so surprised with how I did this. All right, so this is where you come in. Because I want to make this into a little style challenge for next week video. So let's call it blue challenge. This is where you come in. I will be doing a styling challenge. I think I want to do this like weekly now, but let's see how this first one goes. So make a blue outfit. You don't have to use a blue skin tone and post your created outfit underneath my post. I will show you how to do that in one second, but this is my first competition. Don't go hard on me, okay? I've never done this before, but I'm very excited. And I will show my three favorites in next week's daily video because I thought it would be like a fun thing to do to be a little bit more interactive and you guys can enter as well. So the way you do this is once you make your outfit, you go into the comments, then you write a comment and click on this little icon next to the ad. And then you can select any of your outfits so just select the recent one that you made and then say confirm and then it will be linked when you post something please don't tag me because i get so many tags i don't see them so just post them here in the comments and i'm very excited to see what you guys are going to create now before we end today we do have two competition results in so if you're curious how i did let's see city walk oh i got in the top 33 percent i mean it's not the worst but i i'm just not good at making streetwear i'll say it's something i will wear that's for sure too but like i don't know these people are way better at this style than i am next up is floating romance result and i got in the top 56 did i really do that bad i thought my outfit was so cute maybe it's because i don't really use the items from the competition but oh okay fine <laughs> humble moments if you haven't already please consider subscribing or becoming a member i have so much fun doing these daily features i really like doing this and i hope you enjoy them as much as i do and let me know down below your opinions about today's video i would love to hear them thank you all so much for watching. I hope you have a great day and I'll see you in the next video. Bye!